Thanks. That's right, Titanic the Musical. Uh, put back one of my favorite songs that we had cut from the first act for Charles and Carolyn Clark, a, a song called I Give You My Hand. We're putting it back into the London production, which opens, I guess, uh, on uh, December, uh, Jan July 31st. Hi, I'm Daniel Maté. But usually it's got to do with some emotional state or some character moment. Something that's happening either internally or externally. Various characters searching for peace of mind, searching for love, comfort, connection. I've got some new shows coming out, in particular a commission for Chicago Shakespeare Theatre, a family show which I'm co-writing with uh, two colleagues. My name is Alan Gordon. I just won the Cleveland Prize for libretto for my show The Usual. We're, well, we're all driven to create, and uh, if you're not creating, you, you get uh, irritable. So people say, please, go and create and go away from me now. So uh, you, you keep on going. I actually listened and read more attentively during this process than I probably ever have in my life. I felt a tremendous responsibility. I mean, as I, I'm sure Henry and, and Sean did as well. There you go. You answered my question. BCBG. Michelle Poff is now snorting BCBG. And here's Sheldon Harnick. A two CD collection of, it's called Sheldon Harnick Hidden Treasures, and it's by unknown songs or lesser known songs. Two of the songs will be She Loves Me and uh, uh, Sunrise Sunset. And I said, but those are not hidden treasures. And they looked at me and they said, yes, they are, with Jerry Bach at the piano and with you singing them. The other, I did a musical based on the Moliere play, The Doctor in Spite of Himself. And we've had a number of readings which have gone very well. And now I'm looking for an, a pr producer who will do it off-Broadway. We're going to have another Sheldon Harnig musical very soon. Or Broadway. From your mouth to God's ears. It'll happen. <laughs> positions and lots of opportunities for composers, nobody seems to be around helping uh, librettists and lyricists. And one writer one year said, this is enough money so I can finally quit show business. <laughs> Interesting, you only get 10 questions and my ex-wife is off limits. You're on. I found myself checking out some rather out there websites. Are you sure you want to hear about this? Oh, keep going. And then I found her. Hi, this is Nancy. Are you there? Yes. What would you like to do? Uh, I don't know. I, I've never done this before. Oh, you're a webcam virgin! But you don't want to dream. Uh, I'm sorry. I don't think this is going to work. It's not you. It never is me, Kip. It's okay. Disappeared, <laughs> <laughs> vanished in the bloom. So my webcam girl left me all alone in my private room. Out and with your help, I'll figure this out. Yeah, you. Real quick, he says, Get back. 